could we have picked? <laughs> this is mad! <laughs> Good morning, today's vlog already begins in Basildon, which is the home of Dub Customs, and I am in a restaurant car park waiting for Sam to arrive. He's just texted me to say that he has come to a grinding halt on one of the dual carriageways up here, and um, it is a beautiful day. It is a beautiful day, so I decided to wear some pretty outrageous clothes, and why I am doing that is all gonna be revealed in today's video when we head over to Dub Customs to check out and reveal and launch our car that myself and Sam are gonna be taking on the Modball Rally 2016. And we're also going to be announcing a pretty exciting series that is gonna be happening whilst we are on the Modball Rally. Not only are we doing a no tech challenge, so no Google Maps, no SatNav, we are also gonna be doing, or do, doing challenges together, me and Sam, or against each other. So more of that to come. I'm gonna go and have some breakfast, or at least get a table and wait for Sam, and then we are gonna to go to Dub Customs. This is a breakfast of kings. I, th I think we've both done well. Yeah, yeah, first I think, time ever. I think, yeah. I've ordered, I've ordered well, well. Not fish. Because you, no, not fish or like a salad. <laughs> the moment of truth. We have finished our breakfast. I'm now walking behind so I can get Sam in this as well. But he's walking the other way, which isn't helpful. Sorry, <laughs> I'm not used to daily vlogging. We're now going over to Dub Customs to check out the car that we're doing the Mob Ball Rally in. I've got all of the stickers in the back of my car. Let's go and check it out. This is something that I suppose we've both been very excited about. <laughs> yeah. Um, and we're just, we always laugh when we're talking about this car because it is so funny. There are so many elements and aspects of why we've picked this car or why we're doing it in this car, which we'll go over. And then on Sam's channel, we're going to go for our first drive. We're both going to go and drive this car for the first time. I've never featured this car on my channel on purpose. Have you ever experienced, have you ever been, driven one of these cars? I've been in it, okay. but I've never driven it. I've I don't never think I've driven ever it. driven one either. this guy vlog complete i've used the office space up here there is bits of McLaren, a dummy, a McLaren bonnet, and then a very, very, very busy Dub Customs car park. Is this the drift button? <laughs> yeah. What? No? Nope. There isn't actually a button oh. that has the words drift on it. That's what I was hoping for. So we are going to upload my vlog because Dub Customs internet probably, unfortunately, well most internets can't actually handle can't handle my video. YouTube video uploads, so I don't want to kill their My internet. videos are so big because <laughs> of the amazing files I use. <laughs> nah, it is cool this car. I've seen a couple of really nicely specs. I know that you love this Ooh. color, but... It's going crunch, just don't want to run him over. I actually saw a nice one which was black on black, but I kept all the uh, blue accents. GTR, aren't they? Really? Oh, yeah. yeah. But do you know what? What? When I watched the RS on Top Gear and Rory did it, and Rory did a really good piece on the RS, but it just, <laughs> the, the amount that he drifted is so unobtainable in real life. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> I love the exhaust. It is cool. I'm definitely gonna get a GoPro on them. Yeah. Pipes. The pipes. Right, okay, as the car behind, is near enough complete on this side anyway. Me and Sam are gonna get the sponsor stickers going on and make it look really cool. We will fix this, but this is uh, this is your doing, yeah. the 109, and this is mine. This has been a long day. We arrived at about 10 o'clock this morning and um, 
now we are finally getting some stickers on the car. I have to say, we're doing a not bad job. I mean, the big stickers were the first ones. Maybe we should have started small and worked our way up onto the big ones, but <laughs> we are uh, we're not doing too bad, so let's show you the stickers that we've got so far on the car. to get the Rolls Royce out and begin filming for Sam's video. That sounded good. 6.2 naturally aspirated. It is completely silent. This is going to be a totally different experience to driving, well, Sam's car with a Quicksilver exhaust and then my car with a standard sports exhaust. But it's moving. The 6.75 litre engine is on. It is a V12. And this is the car that we're going to be doing at the Mob Ball Rally in. I cannot wait. It is comfort. It is speed. It has got supercar fuel economy because apparently it is pretty shocking. Um, but as cars go, could we have picked? <laughs> this is mad! <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we can get any better. It's outrageous, it's massive, it's got the road presence, but... It's going to be so comfortable. <laughs> it's it's going to be so comfortable. I think we're going to be cruising in style. We are now going to be filming Sam's video of when we both go on first drive, so head over to his channel and check that out. Have you ever driven a Phantom before? No. Me neither. <laughs> One last thing. This is now the challenge element to our Mod Ball Rally. So each leg, London to Paris, Paris to Lyon, Lyon to Monaco, Monaco to Barcelona, Barcelona to Valencia. I've been preparing myself for that. It was well rehearsed. <laughs> Every night before, one of us is going to be doing a challenge. So if Sam is going to be doing the challenge, I will post on Instagram and ask you guys to comment on what Sam's challenge should be that day. So every day on the Mobile Rally, to change up our content, one of us is going to be daily vlogging, the other one will be doing a challenge video. So each alternate times, we are going to be doing a challenge and we need you guys to come up with some challenge ideas. So look out for us on Seen Through Glass and Wallace PJW Instagram. Follow us and then look out for these Instagram posts that we're going to be doing throughout the Mod Ball Rally duration. And then, yeah, challenge us. And we may pick your challenge. <laughs> be nice. Be nice on my challenge day. So right now we're going to jump in this car and go for a drive, film Sam's video, and then I'm going to head home. And I'm pretty sure the M25 is going to suck. Quick disclaimer, that is not the finished article. Some of the stickers aren't on the car and some of the camo hasn't finished. But because we're losing light and the time is around six o'clock, we have uh, sort of got it how it is at the moment. And then the Dub Customs guys are going to be working on it for the next five days or so before we pick it up on the Saturday night for Modball on the 26th of June, Sunday. And I'm so excited. That thing looks bloody crazy. <laughs> So the car has now got a full tank of fuel and I've got Dan in the passenger seat because he's coming back to mine to pick up my AMG GTS for whilst I'm away at Modball. Dub Customs are going to be looking after it um, and then we're going to be working on some interesting bits. I'm going to leave it at that. Uh, so we're going to have to endure the M25. It's actually 20 past 7 because that clock is an hour ahead which is confusing and the other thing as well is the speed cameras obviously a 40 mile an hour 30 mile an hour and sometimes even more or less but this car is in kilometers so I have absolutely no idea what speed I'm doing so Dan just advised me to go slower than everyone else <laughs> <laughs> that's the best way and the only thing that we can do so it's now time to head home after a pretty long but fun day at Dub Customs 
So that's the end of the vlog because I'm just going to get home. You're going to drive the AMG GTS yeah. off. And yeah, I'm sure it's not going to be the end of the day for you, is it? No, got lots to do. <laughs> Still lots to do. Lots of projects. Yeah. So uh, please give it a thumbs up. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video and subscribe if you want to see what me and Sam get up to on the Mobile Rally with the car wrapped by Dub Customs. And I forgot to mention actually, so I apologise to Southern Sky for putting this right at the end of the video, but they are going to be our main sponsor if you couldn't tell by the colours on the car and also the number plate. So a huge thank you to Southern Sky for making quite a lot of the Mobile Rally possible. And yeah, that's it. That's it now. So I will see you guys tomorrow.